Hello everybody, and welcome back to another video. Now, today I will finally be continuing my series here on the channel talking specifically about characters, their arcs, and development in the DC world, with this video focusing on Peacemaker. So without wasting any more time, let us study this character. Peacemaker is a pacifist diplomat so committed to peace that he is willing to use force as a superhero to achieve it. His real name is Christopher Smith, and in the comics, he is the son of a Nazi death camp commandant who became a pacifist to atone for his father's crimes. He later joins an organization called the Pax Institute and becomes Peacemaker, using an array of non-lethal weapons to combat dictators and warlords. In the DCEU, Peacemaker, portrayed by John Cena, makes his debut in James Gunn's Suicide Squad movie. This version of Peacemaker is a ruthless and over-the-top vigilante who believes in achieving peace at any cost, including extreme violence. Peacemaker's character arc in the comics explores his internal conflict between his pacifist ideals and his violent methods. This paradox is central to his identity and leads to various psychological issues including guilt and hallucinations of his dead father. In the post-crisis continuity, Peacemaker is depicted as a more complex character, grappling with his mental instability. He eventually becomes a member of Checkmate, a covert operations team where his skills and unique moral code are utilized for Black Ops missions. In James Gunn's Suicide Squad movie, Peacemaker is initially presented as a villainous figure, willing to kill his own teammates to ensure the success of the mission and maintain peace. The character is further developed in his own Max series, also created by James Gunn. The series delves into Peacemaker's backstory, exploring his troubled childhood, his relationship with his father, and his attempts to reconcile his violent actions with his desire to be a hero. The relationship between Wolfgang Schmidt and Peacemaker in the comics is central to his character. His father's actions as a Nazi commandant uh, haunt him, influencing his extreme commitment to peace. Admiral Wilmore is a mentor figure in the Pax Institute who supports Peacemaker's mission in the comics. Peacemaker's checkmate and members in the comics share a complex relationship with him. In the DCEU, Leota Adebayo forms a bond with him, challenging his beliefs and helping him grow. Peacemaker's father, Augie Smith, whose abusive and racist behavior profoundly affects Peacemaker's psyche. Peacemaker's friend and ally, Vigilante, share violent tendencies, but Vigilante is less conflicted about them. Peacemaker's character evolved significantly in the comics, especially after being integrated into DC. He transitioned from a relatively straightforward Vigilante to a complex character dealing with severe psychological issues. In the DCEU, James Gunn's interpretation of Peacemaker brought a fresh and entertaining perspective. John Cena's portrayal added a unique blend of humor, brutality, and vulnerability, making Peacemaker a standout character. The Max series expanded on this, providing deeper insight into his motivations and personal struggles. Peacemaker is a multi-faceted character whose journey from a pacifist diplomat to a violent vigilante embodies the complex interplay between ideals and actions. Across comics, movies, and shows, his character has been developed to explore themes of peace, violence, and redemption. And that is it for this uh, character study here on Peacemaker. Uh, thank you so much for watching. Uh, I know it took me such it took me such a while to uh, for for all of you who have been watching my character study series on DC characters. Uh, I do apologize for, for taking this long. Uh, some of you may know this, some of you may not know this, but uh, right after I finished my uh, character study on Superman, there were a bunch of things that were going on in my personal life that I briefly touched upon uh, here on the channel. That I was moving across country, and uh, and now I can. For those of you that don't know, I am now. I no longer live in the state of California. I now live in the state of Idaho. Um, so, which is why now, after settling in and all that, well, kind of, well, I'm still kind of settling in. Um, still pretty much settling in, though, for, but for the most part. Um, I was now, why? Because I'm now here. Because I'm still trying to settle in. Not a lot, though, but still just kind of settle in. Um, I'm now able to do this. Um, I'm not really sure if I um, really 
do feel like continuing this a little more, but uh, if I do continue this, I will be doing Wonder. I will be doing Wonder Woman next. So um, if you want to see more character study videos like this, and if you want to see me do one on Wonder Woman, which might be my last one, who knows? Uh, but if you want to see me uh, at least do Wonder Woman next. Uh, for as part of my DC character study series here on the channel, then uh, let me know in the comment section down below, and uh, what and um, just just let me know. And also, if this gets a lot of views, as well as like I just said, there's a lot of demand in the comment section. I will do it. Um, so yeah, that's uh, that's pretty much everything I gotta say. Uh, post comments down below, though. However, let me know what you thought about this. Did you enjoy uh, this this uh, character study video uh, on Peacemaker? Um, did you not? Um, and what are your thoughts on the character overall of Peacemaker? And are you excited for Peacemaker season two? Uh, do let me know. I'm curious what you guys think about uh, think about this video. And uh, wait, and if you're excited as hell for Peacemaker season two, uh, in the comments down below. Also, if you guys uh, did enjoy this video, make sure you guys like button, subscribe. And uh, if you guys know anyone that's a fan of uh, the character of Peacemaker. Uh, or just a DC fan overall, then you should send a video over. To, you should send this video over to them because they might have a good time watching this. Let's come follow me over on Twitter, Vero, and Threads. I'll be posting links to all three of those in the description down below. And also come follow me on Instagram, as it says here on my end screen. Uh, that is the that is the name of my Instagram account. Uh, do all of that. That would mean a lot to me. So, um, anyways, that's gonna be it, everyone. So uh, I will see you all later, and uh, goodbye.